Hey everyone, I'm Mind, and I just got another package in the mail from LEGO. It's currently February 4th as I'm recording this, but I'm not allowed to publish this video until February 20th at 8pm, so it's gonna be a little while until you guys can see it. However, I'm pretty sure that in this box, there's the next wave of LEGO Monkey Kid sets. The only thing is, because I'm filming this on February 4th, these have not been revealed yet. I don't know what any of these are, except for the one that has been revealed. It's a total of seven sets, and I only know what one of them looks like, so I'm very curious to see what these are. So yeah, let's just get this open. <laughs> All right, let's open this up. Wow, look at that. It's so weird to see a Lego set I've never seen before, just like right here in front of me. Okay, so first we have this set right here, the White Dragon Horse Jet. I believe we had the name of this set, but we didn't have any pictures. This looks really cool. I love this one a lot. Wow, I love the colors on this. Excited to get that for you because I don't have any Monkey Kid sets yet. So this, this is really, really cool. There's the back of the box too. All right, let's just pull the rest of these out one by one. Oh, this one's interesting. Monkey Kid's Guardian Lion. Huh. That's a really interesting. It's like a lion mech on four legs. That's really cool. We see so many like two-legged mechs. It's cool to see one that's like more animalistic. I also love all the spider villains. I think those guys are a lot cooler than like the bull demons from the uh, first wave of Monkey Kid sets. The random civilians too look quite cool as well. I uh, <laughs> This is so weird and surreal just to get Lego sets that I've never seen before. But yeah, this looks awesome. <laughs> Here's the back of the box, too. Now let's go for some of the smaller ones on the side. So this one is Red Sun's Inferno Jet. So this comes with, like, one of the Demon Bull uh, characters right here, Bob. <laughs> but yeah, it comes with Red Sun and comes with Monkey Kid. So this one seems to be more of, like, a simpler, more basic one, but I like it. I'm excited to get it built up. There's the back of that one as well. Here's the smallest one right here. This is Monkey Kid's Cloud Bike. This one's fairly simple. I love the design of that character, Spindrax. That looks really cool. But other than that, it looks fairly basic in terms of a monkey kid set, but still pretty cool. That new character, though, with that new home and everything looks really awesome. I like that a lot. All right, on to some more bigger ones. Let's see this one right here. Whoa, okay. Here we have the Spider Queen's Arachnoid Base. This is like a giant moving spider. This is really creative. I love the look of this. The colors are so cool with the, gr uh, the lime green and the purple, and I just love how big it is. It also comes with the actual Monkey King, too. He looks to be, like, captured and tied up and everything this one's really cool i like this a lot and there's the back of that box all right next i believe this is the one we've seen pictures of before this is the monkey kids team uh drone copter this one honestly i don't love the design of but it's got an awesome minifigure selection so i am excited to get all those guys because again as i said i don't have any monkey kid sets before now so this will get me like the entire team this does look cool though i like the colors on it. i'm just not a huge fan of the shape but we'll see if that opinion changes when i get it all built up and there's the back of the box you can see there's quite a lot going on here and then finally here's the biggest one this is another one I haven't seen yet. Whoa, that's interesting. The legendary flower fruit mountain. It comes with a bunch of monkey figures. You have evil Mackie, McKay, uh, brother monkey, sister monkey, baby monkey king, monkey king, apprentice monkey king, monkey kid, and battle monkey king. That is not what I would have expected from this theme, but um, that's really cool. Also, this set just looks really cool. It's huge. I love, like, huge terrain builds, and this is really unique. I love the huge waterfalls coming down and the giant spiraling mounting. This is genuinely awesome. I'm very excited to get this one built. And there's what the back of this one looks like. The uh, whole, like, playset area seems to be, be a bit of a facade, which is a little disappointing, but I like the design from the front, so I'm very curious how this uh, holds up in person. Also, those figures are just really, really cool. So here's a look at all the sets together. A huge thank you to the LEGO group for sending these to me. Like, it's super surreal to me that they sent these to me. Like, thank you so much. I appreciate it a lot. There will be reviews of all of these coming very soon, probably tomorrow morning, because this will be going up at 8 p.m. EST. So tomorrow morning, I'll have reviews up of uh, a couple of these sets. Let me know in the comments which one of these sets is your favorite, and if one's the most popular, I'll review that set first. Personally, my favorites are the Legendary Fruit Flower Mountain, the Spider Queen's Arachnoid Base, and Monkey Kid's Lion Guardian. But if you guys like one of the other sets better, then I'll go for one of those first. Be yeah, stay tuned for reviews of all seven of these sets coming very soon. But I think that's about all I got to say for this video. Once again, thank you so much, LEGO. I appreciate this a ton. This is super awesome that you guys sent these to me. But I think that's about all I got to say. If you enjoyed, please press like, subscribe if you're new. I do LEGO videos like this almost every day, so if you subscribe, you'll be the first to see them. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.